Hey, stop that, блядь! It's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, товарищ. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General? Yep. What about Comrade Korb? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, you're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. Have information. So, my advice to you, my friend? Cooperate. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us, Artyom. Comrade General! Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbut. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky. You're one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Young man, let's dispense with the people of Dr. Corbin and Captain Chase. Hmm? This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lonya must start learning how to improve his, uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Yeah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! <laughs> Still nothing, huh? Hey, bitch! You talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat! Passwords, code names, operation protocols! What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonia. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug. God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastard. And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! You may be my son. Oh. I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything.
I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the Dark One? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Fuck Corbett! Fuck my father! And Morozov! And the revolution and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father, killing his own brother! Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here! Get in there! This is the way to freedom! Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents! Right, sit down, Corbin. Let's talk. About the negotiations in Polis? Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence, after all. Then why did you let the information leak? Damned refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans! The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security, and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified Red Metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? I'm... Moscovin, when you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you. And after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover, so I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Corbett, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the police bureau. Cause one of these days. A frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground in the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention! Comrade General! Soldiers, you are trusted with an important mission. Each group has its task, and you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret, and you must not be taken alive by the enemy. I hope that I am understood. Questions? Can we use radios after we capture the assigned ducts? Only in case of emergency, and on a scrambled frequency. If we're faced with strong enemy counterattacks, do we hold the positions or fall back? Hold them. Anyway, the enemy is unlikely to mount an effective counteroffensive. Comrade General, we have been issued a banner along with the other gear, but we were also made to remove all our markings. We will leave no trace of our operation. Only upon victory and receipt of the following signal will you raise your banner over the captured targets. Further questions? No, Comrade General. Good luck then. Surrender! Surrender! Right. 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 
Now I am in a real spider-infested catacombs, where the General Secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider. That title clearly belongs to General Corbut. I sure would like to know what's on his mind. What did Lesnitsky bring him from D6? What's going to destroy the enemies of the revolution? Only questions and no answers. The only thing that is clear, Pavel has information on the Dark One, which makes him my current target. I'll go stand there around the corner. Kiss your pants already? <laughs> then what's a real man? Well, if you're a real man, why are your hands shaking? Hands don't mean shit. The important thing is nothing else shakes. Okay. Composed. Composed. This is taking forever, so I'll go take a walk in the meantime. Make up your minds already. First you order a patrol, then you expect me to sit here. Second boat, come in, second boat.
What the hell are you doing here? Who's gonna patrol the premises? Me alone? Come on, get to work, all of you. Yes, sir. Iron, stay. Did you take care of the rats? I want them all burnt. Commander, we're not Nazis. Shooting is one thing, but we can't burn people alive. What do you mean, people? Shooting? Are you out of it? Aren't you talking about the refugees? Mm -hmm. Hey, what the? Hey, what, what the hell was that?
It's the only thing that kept me alive. But what the hell happened? Why? You don't know about the bridge? Hmm? Sure, I know the place. I served there for a short time. Well, last year there was one hell of an incident. The guys said that when they came to relieve the watch, hmm? all of the sentries on our side of the bridge were dead. So the lieutenant sent some scouts to the Nazi post on the other end. They returned and said it was the same shift there. Their boots were stained red, like they'd been through a river of blood. Who could have killed so many men? Whatever it was, it wasn't human. Might have been the creature some called a dark rail tracer. One of the guys supposedly made him mad by taking a nut off on a rail junction. That's ridiculous. If it wasn't the rail tracer, the story is even crazier. Must have been a Hansar police task force. How could a task force that size get there undetected? Now, one guy that's possible. I heard of a traitor who smuggled a spy of some kind to the front line through the smithy in a rail car undercarriage. But 30 guys? Nah, that's too complex. We'll never know. But somehow, it happened. They've tripled the guards at the bridge since then. Which reminds me, you should take a walk around the barracks, so that nobody sneaks up on us here. Okay, I will. Got nothing better to do anyway.
Hey, you! Down there! Watch out for your head! Should already store to capacity. These keeps up will be glowing like stalkers. Shut up, it's our job. Just be happy they don't make you collect this crap on the surface. Look, are there going to be any more deliveries today? Well, that was the last one. Great. I'm taking a smoke break. Don't take too long. You know what happens to those who fail to turn up at the roll call?
I'm ready. Starting. Synthesis gas pressure. Standard. Heat exchange of temperature. All right. Methanol output at the separator. Okay, Latna. Compressor speed. Nominal. Catalyst state. A okay. Low range. Normal. Great, got that. <laughs> Congratulations, the service check is complete. Давай, how about the smoke break? Yeah, sure thing. You're free till the... Oh, I have to cut down the drinking. Having to pay everything else, I guess. New war, the business is still going down the drain. Profits down the hill. Scary place. Hi. Huh? Who the hell is there? Shrooms after all. What the fuck is up with these drafts? However I stand, it's still freezing. All the caravans sitting on my thumbs here. Fuck.
you accept the delivery and sign the manifest? I sure did. Where did you put the goods? Wherever I had space left. Top shelves, mostly. Can you be more specific? Specific? Wherever I left the ladder. There's our goods. My ship's nearly over. Best of the other guy when he arrives. All right, all right. I'll go and check if everything's still there. to stand here much longer. Yeah. We should be coming back in the world soon. Did you ever do what duty there? Yeah, it's a creepy place. The station's nearby. There's the machine gun, searchlight, your comrades are there. There's something rustles in the cobwebs and the sound just freezes blood. Why not burn those webs? We do that all the time. In a couple of weeks, the damn beast have everything covered with that shit again. Damn, they sure are a lot of trouble. Maybe we should just weld the gate shut and be done with it. And what if we had to get to Venice fast? How will we go? Take a train to Hansa territory? Forget it. The only way is to keep that damn watch there.
What up? What the hell was Some that? Kind of noise. Hmm. Uh, Damn drafts. Sure Sleep all. deprivation does bleed. Definitely streets. seems a possibility now. Stay down, or your brain goes splat! Wait a minute. Artyom, is it you? I was able to send the report back to the Order via my old acquaintance, Andrew the Blacksmith. At least Miller will know that I am alive, that I haven't completed the mission, but haven't resigned from it either.